Do you want to be a better pilot? Is it time for you to turn pro and master the same skills as a real pilot, but do so at your own pace in an easy module-by-module -module format designed by a real airline captain? If your answer is yes, then FS Academy has got you covered. With training mission packs covering visual flight training, or take it up a notch and get your virtual instrument rating. Get to grips with the instruments in your cockpit. Navigate across country like a pro with Navigator. And so much more. And they're sensibly priced. Want to know more? Details in the link below. Do you want to be a better pilot? Is it time for you to turn pro and master the same skills as a real pilot, but do so at your own pace in an easy module-by-module -module format designed by a real airline captain? If your answer is yes, then FS Academy has got you covered. With training mission packs covering visual flight training, or take it up a notch and get your virtual instrument rating. Get to grips with the instruments in your cockpit. Navigate across country like a pro with Navigator. And so much more. And they're sensibly priced. Want to know more? Details in the link below. NASCAR. Oh, hang on. Oh, are we going? Are you all heading over? I can't head over there. Yes, I can. Hold on. Wikey. Okay, so while we're waiting for people to taxi to runway 03, uh, I'd just like to welcome everybody to the stream and to the flight. Thank you very much for joining us. Stand by, guys. I just need to check something. Standing by. Sorry about that. Just getting the audio sorted out here. Can everybody hear me okay? Yeah, here. Yeah, five, 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 Mark. Yeah, anybody on the, well anybody on the stream, uh, if you could just give us a shout to let us know that you can hear us. Uh, 
and the volume's okay, that would be appreciated. Are we on live weather today? We are on li live weather, but I ask you to set the sim time to 6.30 at takeoff, please, guys. So it means we're going to uh, catch a bit of uh, uh, early dusk on the final landing. Okay, uh, we certainly got a great turnout today. Um, so far, 38 people in the Discord alone. Have we got any first timers here? Yep, I'm saying that you're here on first timer. Well, you're very Mark, Chris Fahey, first timer, this Chris. time with an airplane. <laughs> that often helps. <laughs> yeah, that Lime often. flies, we are here, also first time for me. Oh, well, you're very welcome. Welcome, guys. Great to have you. Thank you very much for taking the time to join us. Um, and uh, during the next two hours or so, I'm sure we'll be able to show uh, with the skills that we've got here, we'll be able to show you exactly how not to do it. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> That's for sure. Uh, it's That's for dang sure. I'm so glad I'm on push to talk. I couldn't stop laughing then. <laughs> Evening, guy. Hi, mate. How are you doing? All right. Keeping a low profile. <laughs> Okay, so um, I just want to give a quick shout out to FS Academy um, for sponsoring uh, this stream. Really appreciate the support uh, that FS Academy is offering the channel. Um, that's great. Thank you very much to David and FS Academy. FS Academy, the guys who do the flight training uh, videos and what uh, packages for Microsoft Flight Simulator. Thank you, David. <laughs> Thank you, David. Okay, so the first leg, gentlemen, is going to be uh, uh, from here. We are. It's a very short hop. It's only about ten point four nautical miles. The uh, uh, heading is seven degrees. We're taking off runway zero three. It's recommend you have live weather and you have the time set to 6.30. Uh, we're taking off and we're landing at uh, North Country, uh, 9 Mike 0, I think it is. And uh, uh, we will... It's a wet landing, so we're landing on water. And it's um, runway 03, so just stay to the right of the airport as you come in, and then you'll turn turn in for final runway uh, zero three west for anybody not sure we are on the Southeast Asia server just confirm Mark that's 1830 hours it is sir 1830 hours okay my pod did I 630 yeah 630 p.m. sorry 1830 hours okay <laughs> so I'm just having a quick look around, see what sort of aircraft we've got here. Let's have a look, what have we got? Uh, Chunzi, what are you in, my friend? Um, the Junkers. I'm looking for it, but I can't Goodness. see it. Uh, about 30 feet up in the air, up at the <laughs> end of the runway. Now look up. Uh, I've got no uh, wheels, so I'm just paused about sort of 100 <laughs> feet at the end of the runway, floating in the sky. <laughs> oh, oh wow. I am I am God looking over you. I see. I see. Not the only one. Excellent. Um, I can see some uh, uh, porters here. PC sixes are here, uh, along with a number of other aircraft. Okay, guys, I think that we've given enough time for people to jump in and join us. Um, Hello to those on the stream. Uh, Curious B, thank you. I think you're flying with us today, I think. Uh, Hudson. I am, yes. Hudson, it's all coming over loud and clear, Mark. Thank you very much, Hudson. Bit of static in the background. Uh, that'll be Tunesy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, Is guys. Hudson or Hudson? So, uh, 
we've got a couple of long legs so we've got plenty of time to chat so I suggest we get to it and we get ourselves up into the air we are going to be heading north initially and then we're going to be turning east uh, and heading towards um, uh, a very very I think this is called uh, is any what I should say is anybody from this area or, mm. or, or I, lived in, I lived in Illinois okay so we're in Minnesota we're in the uh, boundary wilderness canoe areas where we're going to be heading into uh, one of the waypoints is white bang in the middle of that this is about a million acres um, I believe uh, of the most visited wilderness in the States which is something and it shares about 150 miles with the uh, Canadian border so that's the uh, geography lesson over last one up as I always say buys the drinks <coughs> Let's go, guys. Release. Leroy Jane Gaines. Again, because we're in a number of different types of aircraft, if we can keep the speed, max speed, about 105 knots, if we can, guys. <laughs> we'll go 105 knots. How much is that in kilometers an hour? I can't read German. Oh, we're all on a different runway. Oh, I thought it was on the right one. Ah, oh, yeah, no problem. Right, let me check. Flaps down one. Just enable my Toby eye tracker, which I haven't done yet. Let's just get that sorted. There we are. Just let the guys get ahead. Just set my altitude here, 2,500 feet. That's what we need. And let's go. Put my landing lights on. Whoa, we got a real. Wow, we got a crosswind or what here? Wow. Yeah. Wow, that's quite a crosswind. Gear Cross. coming up. It's absolutely furious. <laughs> <laughs> Got my water rudders there. But we don't use the water rudders till we land. Once we're in the water, we don't use them for takeoff. That's flaps up. Let's turn towards the track. Remember guys, for your water rudders, you don't use your water rudders when you're landing uh, or taking off, but you use it just to navigate in the water. For those of you on the Pilatus PC6, uh, you probably have to use a bit of reverse thrust to control yourself. Um, because there's a problem with the rudders. Is anybody here on the Beta 10? No, I don't think we'd see them, Mark. No, we, we couldn't last time. I just wondered whether somebody, anybody had joined us. No, okay. Well, if anybody listening in is on the uh, Beta uh, or Beta, then uh, it would be great if they could uh, just put that in as a bug that uh, the Pilatus water rudders don't work they haven't for some time it's it's not new I was going to be in the Pilatus but I changed my mind um, now in the uh, um, Clipcraft uh, X-Craft what am I in? The X -Cup. I don't know X-Cup 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 <laughs> I think you're in the twilight zone Setting the altitude, vertical speed, we just need a little bit of up, there we go, 
Guys, we need to climb to about 2,500 feet. How are you doing in the Junkers? Um, well, there's a reason I chose it. It means I can go off and have a wee or a walk or <laughs> do my taxes or something, and then it's still flying. <laughs> I'm actually sitting on the sofa watching a film. Oh my god. It's just so easy to fly, it's just so relaxing. You don't actually have to do anything at all. It's like a Tesla of aircraft. On the stream, hello to Disco Day 50 and Robert Mixon. Uh, thanks. Yeah, we will have a great flight. Certainly will. Thank you very much. Hello, Disco Dave. Hello, Dave. Disco Dave. He usually flies. Why are you not fly, Dave? I saw him, but now he's gone again. Okay, I'm just I'm now just starting to move into cruise. Um, today, guys, the flight plan is just a general guide. Uh, we might be altering it slightly as we go. Is everybody up? Uh, everybody with us? Yep. I don't know. That's great. Nobody well, shouting, hey, wait for me, except for Tunesy. <laughs> Womble Way? Is Womble Way here? Is he, he up here? Oh, yeah. Are you up in the air here? Oh, yep. oh, oh well, okay. Lovely. Okay, don't worry, guys. <laughs> so, what's your recommended cruise speed, please? 105. 105, sir. Oh, man. Make me stall out in this thing at that speed. 110, but I have what? to gain a little. What, what are you flying? Twin Otter. <coughs> yeah, I'm doing 105 in a Twin Otter. 20 degrees of flap. I know, I'm just, I'm just <laughs> exaggerating for dramatic purposes. I had 30 degrees of flap in the goose and I'm still doing about 110. Oopsie. What is my doing? Um, do we have a course change here? We do, don't we? I don't know what my aircraft is doing. Are we landing here? No? We land. Yes, yes, sir, we're landing here. Oh. oh. <laughs> ah. Alright. I'll come in from the other end. Yeah. Anyone know uh, which uh, way the wind is coming? It's coming from the east. Not a bad day though, really clear. I take my, I take the autopilot off. I don't know what it's doing. Autopilot on a bush flight? Yeah, so I can uh, manage the stream, guys. Convenience is king. What the hell? Uh oh. We pack the gears. Now the first runway is should be there on your right guys uh, that uh, small rectangular shaped inlet there that's it somebody's shouting don't sink <laughs> yeah it does it all the time no matter what plane I'm in we're crazy should be landing in this small area here guys 
to see it. <laughs> Just starting to slow down a little bit. Hello to Lee. Thanks for joining us. Laps now full. Laps full and coming in. I can see Sun Oil Keller, Toby Air. I'll try and judge this externally. This could be a disaster. Yeah, I'm going to be making some waves with this big fat frail line coming in. Oops. Oops. Excuse me. <laughs> okay, let's get rid of that. Oh, you picture. don't want to slow down. Slow down, girl. Come on. Now I'll get my water rudders down. There we go. I have a tendency to push on the brakes. That's not going to do me a lot of no, good. No, it won't help you. No. Hey, there comes the Yunkers. Bouncy, bouncy. Yeah. There goes the Yunkers. Yeah, there goes the Yunkers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's Anybody a good... want to go water skiing? Yeah, come on, Jonesy, oh, that's a go around in anybody's book. No, 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 I'm drifting. Perfect. <gasps> you can fly, fly this thing sideways. Right, let's just turn this look, around. Look, someone else has chosen the Yunkers. There's at least two more Yunkers there, so look, I am not alone. No, there's a couple in the trees. <laughs> Who's in the Deutsche Rings Junkers? Awesome. Good livery. I'm not sure we've all landed in the same place. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we haven't. Uh, Close enough. Yeah, I saw it, what? It, 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 it's the big wet patch. <laughs> There's a lot of bobbing around going on. Well, I see I, you, Mark, so at least I know I'm in the right place. It's, it's to bite the bullet and buy the Yonkers, so I stop seeing these stupid A320s everywhere. <laughs> it's a great plane, actually. Right, so is uh, Dr. Oculari with us today? No, I didn't think so. This was his uh, suggestion. Um, he did send me a message. He's not very well, so we wish him all the best. Uh, he, unfortunately, he's just caught a bout of COVID. Oh, yeah. So, Dr. Oculari, if you're listening, uh, we wish you all the best, my friend. Here, here. Get well soon. Okay, guys. So, on to the second... Um, leg and this one is uh, going to be particularly interesting for Tunesi and those in the Junkers. Um, here we are <laughs> departing 28 nautical miles. Heading is 332. Um, we, it is a landing, uh, hard landing. Um, in, I beg your pardon, it's a touch and go runway 05 and it is at uh, airport Kilo Echo Victor Mike 11th Virginia I think it's called now there are three runways when you get to that airport two of them are um, asphalt or um, concrete they are both closed so the only uh -huh. open runway is a grass runway and it is runway 05 so keep to the right of the airport and then turn in on the grass runway so a little bit of a challenge it's a touch and go um, and we should plan to take off uh, basically the opposite direction to which we landed it's 
So let's go, guys. No, I'm applying full power, but I'm not <laughs> no. going anywhere. No, I'm in there. I'm, sure I'm in the, the trees. Is hot down. I don't know if it's the wind. I'm struggling to turn here. Yeah. You got your water Ooh, that's a one. There we go. A lot of wind. Water rudders up. What is, what is the button for water rudders? Control W. Control W. Ah. Thank you. I was really struggling to get up there. Let me see. I heard Viagra works wonders. <laughs> <laughs> Ouch. I'm sorry, that was a big old beach ball you tossed me, Mark. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's time for a stiff drink. <laughs> oh. oh! Those water rudders didn't come up. No wonder I had a problem. <laughs> Three three five, you said. Three three two, sir. Yeah. All right, thank you. I'm still um, joining because I can just go. And altitude once again, uh, two thousand five hundred. <laughs> All right, got my throttle. Flaps are up. Oh, that's going to be a real nice sunset, I think. Is it that windy? <laughs> Is there a switch in the cockpit of the Cub for the water rudders? Or do you have to map it? You have to map it, as far as I'm aware. I stand to be corrected, but I haven't found one. That would explain the turning being quite difficult, then. A very slim switch, close to your feet, usually. Oh, is it? Oh yeah, look at it, it's down by, in the Cessna, it's down by the fuel selector. Little handbrake type thing. Yeah. Okay. You're dead right about the rudders in this Pilatus, they're terrible. I don't know what my autopilot is doing here. It's not doing what I'm asking it. My throttle's gone. <laughs> House. Where? What, what, what aircraft are you in? Pilatus. Oh, shouldn't have a problem with the throttles. No, it's Can not. You... Um, it was fine until I landed. Whoa. Uh, put it in reverse and it won't. Um... Let's can, try again. Can you move yep. it with it? Try and move it with the mouse. Whoa. No, it's moving in and out, but it's not. It's not uh, rubbing up. Try uh, auto start control E maybe. Alright, try that. Be nice when Milvies get together and get their uh, float version on the market again. Yeah, the Kodiak too would be nice. Yeah, and the Kodiak, yeah. Hi Mike, oh, the, uh, the X-Cub float is uh, default. Mark, this wasn't a good idea picking this aircraft. <laughs> That's why I'm in the X Cub. <laughs> yeah, well, you could have warned us. <laughs> yeah. I did actually post this morning, but uh, uh, it was only okay. this morning that I, I I made that decision. Oh, this is buggy. Right, you have to change. Something's wrong. What's wrong with this? Right. Plan B. F. Four. Y. I think somebody's got their mic on open.
Yeah, if you're going to leave your mic open, please uh, go to a headphones arrangement. If you're going to listen to your speakers, push to talk, please. I think I finally... I don't know. I think I've got the auto the autopilot on uh, on nav working. I've been having a real problem. Right. Full throttle and uh, F four and Y worked. <laughs> That's weird. Yeah. Mark, I'm having the same issues you are. What are you doing to make? I, I can't get it to work in nav mode. Okay. What I do is I get right on the track almost lined up um, go to nav mode it veers off but then it come it brings itself back because I was going in full circle it just with circle yeah, and that's I what did, didn't I, know if it was going back or not yeah I, I um, it, it was veering me off 90 degrees and I was just uh, I was just killing the autopilot and after a couple of attempts it's done it also, sometimes with the G3X mod, you have to check whether the leg gets um, activated automatically. Yeah, I did. I, I, and in my case, I activated the leg. Um, that's a good point, yeah. You need to activate the leg. If uh, on the bottom right-hand corner, you've got your um, two dials, the, the fatter one at the bottom and the thinner one on top, it's the bottom one. Switch it to from map to flight plan and you can activate the leg if you haven't done so already. Whoa, look at that view. Oh. Maverick, how are you doing now? Yeah, I'm fine, back on track. So how did you solve it? Uh, F4 and Y, dare I say it. <laughs> full <laughs> throttle, it was full throttle, but it just, it's like the water magnetised me to it. Just couldn't go. Yeah, I had that problem as well, and I ended up in the trees, couldn't get out. Yeah. If I have the same problem, I'll switch aircrafts at the next one. Well, if you have a look around at the scenery, guys, there's beautiful scenery here with the mixture of the water and the forest and the land. Uh, for anybody who's been lucky enough to actually come here in the real world, it must really be special seeing this from the air. Anybody else using that map enhancement mod? Google Maps and looks like the door of this. No, I'm using default. Have we got rain up ahead? We could have. It, it looks I'm like it. Yeah, I'm seeing rain ahead. Just adds to the spice, guys. That will be bad. That's why I have mm. a closed cockpit. I've had a couple of short spells in the B to 10. The um, name tags on and off is a great feature. Absolutely. Can you, how easy is it to exit the beta once you've been in? Um, I've had three attempts and I couldn't get out of it three times. I mean, I had some problems with my PC, so I was doing clean installs anyway. So basically you had to reinstall? Yes. <laughs> uh, and that means that you have to reinstall all your add-ons and all that? I didn't have any add-ons. It was, um, I, I took everything out of the community folder. But I, I've, I've been having some problems with Windows. So I've been doing full clean installs recently. Okay. okay. So, so just, just be mindful if you are going to jump in, Mark. So I'd like to, but I, I'm not sure I can face a full reinstall. 
I think judging on the forums as well, it's taken a hit in the last um, update. Oh, great. What do you mean by taking a hit? Performance is down. Oh, really? Yeah. I think Xbox, Xbox got a boost and PCs went backwards. Won't the final release be out before uh, the next uh, group flight, Mark? Yes, it will be. It will be. I'm looking at somebody in front of me. There's no name tag, but I think the Y key is being excessively used. Hey, that was me. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Excuse my language. Excuse my language. Sorry. Rumble. Yeah, you thought you were going to get away. I thought, my oh, God, so uh, I've, I've <laughs> never seen a PC6 do 400 knots an hour. Uh, <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Anybody else about to go IMC here? Yeah, it won't it's be long for me. They get that way. <laughs> what was that guy? There's a big cloud. Yeah. Goes all the way to the ground. Oh. Mm -hmm. I got a sunroof. <laughs> <laughs> I was prepared to have my feet wet, not my head. Yeah, it's all in the in the name of balance. <laughs> Bring a whole new meaning to feet wet. Yep. Or the YK, of course. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Uh, it is. It looks like it's right the way, all the way down. What the thunderstorms look like in Florida this time of year. Well, we'll just fly through it. It'll be fine. It's not the rain. Really light rain. <laughs> It'll just make finding the grass runway uh, all mm. more difficult. Again, reminder, guys, that there's three runways, uh, two uh, that are hard service and one that's grass. That is quite hard to spot. Uh, the two hard runways are closed. So keep to the right and, uh, and then turn in. Uh, for those <laughs> not, then for those not sure, you may be better off overflying and looping round and come in for a touch and go. I am uh, uh, I'm going a little faster because I want to land and uh, uh, get on camera your magnificent touch and goes, guys. <laughs> Bloody hell. No pressure there. No. <laughs> uh, that'll teach me for laughing earlier. You're going to be sorely disappointed. Uh, we got uh, Dream of Wings on uh, the Discord, and he says uh, rain helps make aeroplanes clean. Uh, uh, that's a good point, actually. <laughs> he read my mind. I was just thinking the windscreen's a bit uh, a bit dirty. <laughs> uh, yeah. and, and JT Mayers, who I guess has been in this area, said, uh, "Yeah, lots of mosquitoes." I can well imagine. Well, I think I'm going to have to come in at about 400 knots to overcome friction. <laughs> Strange, you've got rain on the left window, but nothing on the windscreen. Th this, is a <laughs> this is a ground landing, so you probably won't have a problem. Uh, is it grass? It is, sir. Oh, yeah, it's just quite skiddy on the grass. That's good. And it's raining. Yeah, it's quite grass. Right. Down. We've already got floats. Turn my... Off. Can't see much though. Now you're going to have to overfly, I think, guys. I've lost my mouse in the cockpit in VR. Does anyone know how to get that back? Click the middle rotary. Click your middle button. It's not falling on the floor. I've been struggling with that. I've been struggling with that now for about a week, and I everything I do, I cannot get the mouse to uh, to work in VR. Oh, that worked. Thank you. No worries. Try to create our another, lives in, in VR. Create another mouse profile, and use the copy profile. See if that works. Uh, it's working. Magic. Oh dear. A bit misty. Better rain here. In ten square miles rain. 
Oh, going to be doing a Glenn Miller and disappearing. Doing a Glenn Miller. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> Sorry, guys. It's scattered at 2,900. Well, Buddy Holly and a Richie Valens and... That's bye, it. guys. Nice knowing you. K-E-Y-M, is it? Mike, uh, Discord well, is see. free, my yeah. friend. Join the Simhanger Discord. I can uh, see the wrong way. Not just for fly-ins, but for help, hear me? assistance, and so on. I've been serenaded as well. It's usually Sky Trex gets those in yeah, before they get one in early. You <laughs> used the term serenade very loosely there, Dad. I did. <laughs> well, I'm easily easily sweet talked. <laughs> like, more like a caterwaul. <laughs> okay. Remember, glide, guys, uh, put your gear down. It's Stay down. Here. Right, I'm coming in hot. Full fall. Which runway are we landing on? Runway zero five. Oh, Easter, are you practicing on the water, are you? <laughs> no, I'm not. Touch and go. Yes, touch and go. Four flaps. Well, this is. Uh, you just beat me in there, Mark. Maybe not. Um, right behind you, Scott. Oh, there's an airport. I'm down. Right. That runway's closed, Tunesy. <laughs> Cracker Jack, Sky Jacks, that's the wrong, wrong runway. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you guys would go go for the hard way. This thing sits higher than I'm used to. Wow, this looks amazing. Golf mic coming in. See, this is this just broke broke the illusion for me because there's way too many cars in that parking lot. Out here in the middle of freaking nowhere. Moose P, fantastic. Limes Fly VR, fantastic. A Caribou One, nice one. UPS, get out of the way. Pigs Fly, nice one, my friend. Stored Knight, nice to see you again. Fog of War coming in. Well, was coming in. A bit too hot on that. Palmer Height. Not sure where you're landing, mate. <laughs> oh, you guys are on the ground. off to the right somewhere. <laughs> the lone wolf is down. Very nice. David TFS. Nice landing, sir. Cracker Jack. Lovely one. Saucier Pen. 464. Thank you. Tony Dark Zero, very nice. Bumble Way, you're down. Nice one, my friend. Oh, I won't go up. Please go up, aircraft. Come on. No, 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 no. Crummy bread, <laughs> I don't know where you're going. <laughs> oh, my God. No. It really is. I touched, but I didn't go. <laughs> Did you crash? <laughs> no, I haven't crashed. I'm just skidding very slowly to a very slow halt. <laughs> on the concrete one where it's fine, and there's very grippy grass. For those of you in the cub, uh, anybody in the X cub, it's probably a good time to change tanks. Thanks for the reminder. Right felt heavy. What's the runway heading here? Okay, we're going straight on to the next leg. We're heading north, uh, three degrees, um, uh, to Waypoint Juliet Uniform Delta Oscar Delta, and then 
in front of that is Big Rice Lake and the plan is to land there at Big Rice Lake. However guys, just a quick uh, a note. I'm still waiting for ATC to confirm we can land there. Apparently there's some sports on, water sports. So we may get diverted but that's the plan at this stage. Intriguing. It's a little bit dark. Gear up. I'm up again. Flaps up. You got to be quite gentle with this cub, don't you? With these great big floats on. Altitude again, 2,500. Heading is 3 degrees and it's uh, about 15 nautical miles to the next waypoint. And directly in front of that waypoint, uh, uh, the waypoint is uh, uh, Jadod, Juliet Uniform, Delta Oscar Delta. And then immediately in front of that is uh, Big Rice Lake. But... Uh, don't land until we know we've got permission to land from uh, the authorities because uh, I've been warned we may get diverted. <laughs> Our reputation precedes us. <laughs> it does, sir. <laughs> Nobody's shocked, I'm sure. <laughs> the price of infamy. I'm going to risk uh, auto nav again. Oh, and it's worked. On your right, Mark. Oh, Oops. oh I see you. Nice. <laughs> Perhaps a little unstable, but nice. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Vikey helps. Vikey helps. Looks like there's a big mine over here. <laughs> that is a deep mine. Yeah, there's some fantastic scenery here, guys. There really is. Shame I can't see it for the weather. <laughs> uh, I'm coming out of it now. We should have scattered at 29, 42, broken at 110. As you look ahead, as we head towards Big Rice Lake, you'll see uh, a road leading directly up uh, towards the lake, a uh, very straight road, and uh, that's the direction that we want to be heading in, straight up the road. Hello to Centurion, thanks for joining us. Nice to have you here. When are you joining us for a flight, my friend? Hello from uh, Chris, Pie in the Sky Tours, saying hello to everyone. Chris, thanks for joining us. Nice to have you. Hey, Chris. How you doing, buddy? How you doing, Chris? Hey, Chris. Hey, Chris. It's about time you joined us for a flight, Chris. I second that. Yeah. Uh, yep. I think we scared Chris it. is in Southeast Asia. All of his flights are bad times for me. Uh, I, 
I, I think we scared him off with a lost flight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's got another video to do. He's got another few counseling sessions, yep. Yeah. yeah. Again, a reminder guys, stick to around about 105 knots if you can, so we're more or less staying bunched together. Boys, we lose our horde credentials. Indeed. Hangar horde. Yeah, we get downgraded to just a nuisance rather than a pest. <laughs> It's fantastic seeing all the... We've got 39 people in the Discord, so we've got at least 39 people flying with us today. That's fantastic. What about squadron? Don't know if you guys have noticed, but uh, graphic card prices are dropping quite quickly now. Yeah, they are. Yeah. Um, I think, Just I can't remember where it was. I'm going to guess scan computers, but don't hold me to that. I was quite surprised. A 3084735, I think it was. Yeah, that's, that's a great price. The euro and the dollar are almost at, right at the same value right now. Yeah. Make sure if you get a 3080, get a 12 gig, not the 10 gig. Well, you know, it shouldn't be too long before we see the 4000 series, guys. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking is the, the, the more the price is dropping, the 3000 series, the closer the 4000 yeah. series you got it. is getting to release. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's it's old money. stock. Well, I keep, I keep my eye on uh, the bigger retailers and uh, not only here but but elsewhere and just about all of them are getting sales and price drops on the nvidia graphics cards so um summings up i i reckon yeah. they've, i reckon they've got the message to say start clearing your stock yeah well best buy best in the buy. us had a 3060 ti for 400 dollars it was a new yeah. one yeah that's that is a great price yeah. that's where they belong it's a good card, but if you want a really good VR experience, I don't recommend it. Get a 3080 or better. Yeah. I was saying that uh, the outboard, all the chips they need, and all of a sudden the crash with the uh, miners came along, and they've got so many chips still in stock. Yeah, thank God for that crash. Those miners were yeah. just... <sighs> hey, guys. Uh... Just in case you're a miner, I'm not going to brag on you too much, but... Okay, Captains, uh, ATC have uh, been in contact. We can't land here. Here we go. Um, uh -oh. all... What a surprise. Uh, what a surprise. <laughs> However, uh, we've been very fortunate that uh, we've been redirected. Now, if you can see Big Rice Lake in front of you, yeah. on the east side, the right-hand side, there's a river, and it leads off to a slightly sp well, substantially smaller lake. It's called a puddle. Uh, I thought somebody <laughs> would say that. <laughs> that. And the puddle jumping. And we have to land there, guys. So uh, we're not landing in the big lake. We're going to land uh, on uh, uh, the smaller lake, um, or shall I say, like reservoir. Um, the one that looks like a kidney. That's the one. Oh. So let's head over there. And uh, the best thing, fly over Big Rice Lake, follow the river uh, between the two lakes follow the river down and land in uh, the puddle that's just the aeronautical version of the staff entrance isn't it <laughs> <laughs> sorry uh, you can use the staff entrance yeah. please yeah, tra yeah. the tradesmen's <laughs> oh the lady of the man has just looked at us all and gone uh, staff entrance yeah <laughs> well and wipe your feet <laughs> I'm not sure we all fit there. Mr. Carson, the staff entrance, please. <laughs> it's not the first time the lady of the manor wants to take it in the tradesman, to be honest. 
So again, guys, that, guys that, as you come over Big Rice Lake on the right hand side uh, to the east, you will see um, a river joining the two lakes. Follow the river and land uh, in the small water area uh, well, that's next to Big Rice Lake. We won't fit in there. Yeah, we will. Yeah. Of course we will. It Believe looks, me, we've, uh, we've fitted in much smaller. Longer from the south. It's not the getting in, it's the getting out. Winds out of the east, seven knots. Here we go. Coming back on the par. Flaps down. Yeah. Looks a little longer running southeast to northwest. Yeah. For those brave, you may want to just touch in on, in on the river, but hey, that's up to you. There's a bit of a beach on the northwest side, so I'm coming in from the southeast. And if I go too long, I'll just skid up on along along the beach there. <coughs> And don't forget to gear up. Gears up for water landing. Yeah, I've. I've got my water rudders down just in time. Yeah, I had no idea where they were. I was looking around. So what all I done, because I know the next place they're gonna be, I done this. So I've got my pack on there. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so this is that lot coming towards I'm sure if I got Ready? Well, I'm gonna have a quick look in the Discord see who's transmitting. One second. <laughs> Love you to go. <laughs> How does Discord work? How can I speak to that to put my info on? <laughs> yeah, Diablo. Okay. Hey, somebody watching Diablo Faulty Pablo. Towers or something in the background there? Uh, Diablo Pablo, if you could just watch, we can pick up the background noise, guys, please. If you don't mind going to push to talk or mute when you're not transmitting. Thank you. Sorry, guys, I do apologize. I'm new to this. <laughs> no problem. I've actually, I missed you on the initial flight, but I've managed to create my own path with the coordinates you gave me, and I've just, I'm now seeing all of you heading towards... Um, oh, flaps. Yeah. Okay, gentlemen, we're off to the next uh, leg, and this is a bit of a longer leg. Uh, we're going to take off from the puddle. Um, we're going to head uh, initially on a heading of 49 Oops. degrees to uh, uh, 12 Delta, 1, 2 Delta, which is Tower Municipal. We're going to overfly that and we're also going to overfly Shagawa Lake and go, oh. on, and go on to Snowbank Lake. So a bit, a bit of a longer leg. It's probably 30 odd uh, nautical miles. And when you're ready, um, I suggest taking off north-south or south-north because um, it is the, the longer one. L let's get away. Do you lift your rudder up to take off? You do, sir. You, you use your rudder for steering on the water, but for once you're lined up for takeoff and also for landing, um, raise, raise the water rudders. Otherwise, they get uh, in the real world, they get damaged, of course. Okay. I think 30, 30 knots, isn't it, Mark? Uh, 30 knots? Yeah, something like that. 20 yeah. or 30 knots. Well, these reverse thrusters, I can land short on, on a much smaller puddle, I think. Laps are down one. Uh. <coughs> Let's hope I've left myself. <laughs> Yoke back. <coughs> Get her up. Man, they got to fix Ease these things. The you got uh, terraced oh, water here. Yeah, yeah, there is a bit of that. Oh, and I'm up. 
Yeah, kind of get there. back up up onto the higher water though. We need locks. <laughs> Laps up. Once again, uh, recommended altitude 2,500 feet. Mark, is the next one a flyover? It is the next two actually are a flyover. Um, we the next landing is a snowbank lake, or if you're on if you're on the Xbox, it'll be Fall Lake. Okay, thank you. Coming back on the prop a little bit. Don't need to climb too fast. Looking for about 2.5 during the climb here, initially. 2.5 RPM, that is. <sighs> Do -do -do -do. Let me see if I can risk GPS. Yes, looks like I'm okay. It's working all right. So, uh, just picking up where we were before we were so rudely interrupted with that redirect. Uh, I don't know, but I'm going to guess. I, I'm going to think October, November for the 44,000 series NVIDIA cards. I don't know what other people think. Yeah, it's in time for Christmas. Would seem to make sense, I, w I would guess. Yeah. Sounds right. The only concern I have is whether or not NVIDIA would delay that because they get stuck with a whole lot of production because uh, a lot of cards are not being eaten up right now for mining. Yeah, it's possible. I would imagine there's going to be a drop in normal sales as well with the way bills are going up and things like that and petrol. So For sure, that's inevitable. I think it's all slowed down, yeah. Yeah, very valid point. We reckon the 4070 Ti is going to be faster than the 3090. Sorry, say again. Yeah, they were saying that the 4070 Ti is going to be faster than the 3090. Well, they're going to 5 nanometers. Yeah. But that's lot. mainly a power thing, I think. Yeah. Consumption. But does it come in pink? <laughs> <laughs> Have we all got to rate our power supplies to run the bloody thing? Yeah. No, maybe not if they keep everything the same. Going yeah. from, I think they're going from 10 to 5 nanometers. That should decrease the amount of uh, power required. So all other things being equal, it shouldn't make a difference. Yeah, I'm running a, an 850 with a 3090. So. Well, I won't be getting the Series 4, I'll wait till the Series 5 comes out. <laughs> are we landing at 12 land. Delta? We are not, sir, we're just overflowing. Well, I think I read that the 4060 is going to be um, faster than the 3090. Hey, Steve Jones, thank I you for joining us. I expect at least us. four to five years out of a new car. Appreciate it, my friend. Appreciate yeah, your too. channel support as well. Well, I'm hoping to sort the sim out and I can stay with my 3080 Ti for a couple more years. I'm saving up to have a bath in October. <laughs> yeah, that's the way it's going. And a hot meal for Christmas. That's my yeah. tea for this year. <laughs> well, Just eat the uh, meal in the bath. On the Joking aside, it's very sad. Yeah. On, yeah, the, sad. on the stream, guys, uh, Steve Jones, he's been a long-term subscriber reckons that landing uh, on the water looked a little like Oshkosh on the water. <laughs> <laughs> Oshkosh bagosh. Yeah. Oshkosh blosh. Splish, yeah, splish splosh Oshkosh. <laughs> now we got a nice formation of free mark left and right. And I've got them on camera, yeah. This is a lovely little airfield too. I like this. Nice. 
Ah, Disco Dave, you are with us. Ah, there you are. Disco, Disco Dave. Back to the wah, 80s. Wah, wah. <laughs> Quite a nice little airport there. Slave. Tango Theo, are you, are you new? Is this your first time? Yep, first time here. You're flying like it. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's <laughs> that nice. Uh, I, I apologize for the horde, but <laughs> there's nothing you can do. <laughs> Don't apologize for us. It was Skytrex. Nothing to do with us. <laughs> ah, look at Throw me under the bus, Junzi. Where are you? I'm going to buzz your. Little Yankee Doodly, it's just but so you did it, you did it style, but... cultured, man. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Boris Bold, nice to have you with us, and Crummy Bread. Cheers, mate. Awesome. Really good, really good video on the uh, resetting the Toby Eye Tracker mark. Thank you very much. Yeah, that was a good video. Well, I think you'll find most of mine are. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Careful, you got to keep your head inside the plane, Mark. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. God. Yeah. Oh, dear. Good God. I'm talking uh, about humble. Welcome to Cloud Action. Uh, nice to have you with us. Are you on voice, my friend? No, I don't see you there. So, oh, you know. <laughs> Limes Fly VR, welcome. And Captain Quasar, welcome. Yep. Hello. Captain Quasar, you're no stranger to the fly-ins, of course. You've been with us oh, many no. a time. Just have to say to the other um, Twin Otter pilots out here, we, we're flying pretty much the best-looking darn plane in the sky at the moment. Ha. I love it. Oh. Does it still sound terrible? Soaring guy, thanks for joining me. us. I don't know what, friend, what everybody's griping about the, the sound of this thing. Testing. Sounds yeah, like two well, big to be twin here. prop engines. But every mother thinks their along. baby is beautiful, even if yeah. it looks like the back end of a duck's. Back end of an otter. Yeah. So well, I mean, but the Pilatus, that's, I mean, that's, that's ugly. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Very ugly. You've yeah. got to love her. Guys, we got four cubs all together here. Looks amazing. Bakerfly, how are you, my friend? I'm doing great, Mark. Thanks. You're just behind me. Yep. That's what he said. Oh, oh, oh. Stored Knight, how are you? Again, no stranger to the fly-ins, often with us. Doberman, commonly, hi, known, hi. commonly <laughs> known as Maverick, and also known as the prize winner. He's just, Thank he's, you. He, he's won <laughs> Three the times last, luck. He, I think he's won the last two in a row. Yeah. Yeah, wh Three what's times. your commission on that, Mark? Third time lucky, guys. <laughs> yeah, you need to you need to play the lottery, mate. <laughs> yeah. Whoever yeah, wins the last one should be taken out of the running for the next one. Yeah. My wife said to me, "Go for it. Don't feel guilty." <laughs> yeah. No, I right. feel guilty. You should. Sure? I don't feel guilty. Uh, no way. It Deeb, all evens out, right? Deeb's two thousand and three. Yeah. Welcome. How uh, you doing, Mark? You well? Very well, thank you. Thanks for joining us. Always a pleasure. And Tony Dark Zero, one of the regulars. Really nice to see you here again. Oh, I see you're just catching me up. I need to get and pedal down. What is my plane doing? Oh, that isn't me. Sun <laughs> 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 uh, Oil Keller, my Caribo. Mark, nice to be here with you. It's always a pleasure. It's great to have you here. I really appreciate it. And Buzz MC, another regular. Thanks very much, my friend, for joining us. 
<coughs> Spyglass 27, thanks for joining us again. No problem, my pleasure. And the Lone Wolf. Um, and Pigs Fly, nice to have you here. <coughs> Another regular Duck Speak, thanks for joining us. Great to have you along for the ride. Come on, how you doing? How many of you guys are actually using the Toby? I am. This is uh, Steve T. Come meet Red. I am. Yeah, it's great. I'm using it right now, actually. Love it. Yeah. USB, I'm using so it. am I. Yeah, I'm using it right now. I tried yeah. it for the first time a couple of weeks ago, and I have to say I did not like it. I'm really? a minority, I know. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's a personal thing, but overall, no, didn't really like it. A lot of it has to do with what settings you use. That's really important. Less is more, yeah. Yeah, I had to work with mine a good bit to get the settings right. First, I didn't like it until I got the settings right. Watch that video of Mark's, and his settings are pretty much what I use as well. The truck mine I are, was a bit like that. I want it to be good. It set up properly. Yeah, mine, mine are close to Mark's, but I had to tweak mine a little bit. I think my head is not quite as big as Mark's. Ouch. <laughs> Ouch! Oh, oh. <laughs> second time on the stream, Mark. <laughs> Double entendre. That was the well ham crafted. Xbox users are more than Might welcome. Might need to pull on that. <laughs> I just got somebody on stream asking if Xbox users can join. Uh, who's on no. Xbox today? I'm on, I'm on Xbox. I am, guys. <laughs> Great. I'm a complete newbie, so I do apologise. I'm doing. I'm trying my best. I miss your initial takeoff, um, but I matched my own way to you guys. Um, it's quite exciting. I can now see a few of you, and I'm heading towards. Well, I believe I'm heading towards M MN41. That's, yeah, that's, that's right. correct. Yes, that's right. It's a yeah, puddle landing. Then, then, Are we landing or watering? No, no. We, this is another flyover, guys. Oh. Dip down and wash your hands as you go by. It's <laughs> Shagawa Lake. And on your right hand side you should see the town as we cross over by the runway. And uh, then we're turning on a heading of uh, 79 degrees. And we're going to be heading to Snowbank Lake or Fall Lake. And uh, we're going to do a, a landing there. I'm guessing since the lake it's a water landing, Mark. It is, sir. Could be a dry lake. Lake Mead. Huh. Yeah. Lake Mead land on the almost beach again. a dry lake. Like yeah. most of the southwest of the United States at the moment. Yeah, the uh, southern part of the UK they're talking about they're already bringing in host pipe bands and uh, I think we're in for more restrictions as time goes on yeah remember if it's yellow let it mellow if it's brown let it go down hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god I like the delay reaction there Mark no, I just didn't have press to talk on. <laughs> <laughs> no, you weren't. You were surreptitiously finding that button that says he's definitely not winning. <laughs> 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 it's like Austin Powers, you know, with the, what's his name, with the little button where they disappear. Right, I'm going to piss some water here. Flame. That's all right. I've already won one. Come on, kiss the water. Come on, have a little kiss. Here we are. I'm now just uh, coming up on uh, coming there we over go. the airport. Again, guys, it's a flyover. How close a flyover? I did a splash and go. You're more than welcome to do that if you want. I shall have I a go. Appreciate it. Try and catch a fish.
Is anyone going to pick the Harrier up later on this year? Oh yes. <laughs> Got an F-35 I haven't even flown yet. Bit light 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 light. Kiss that water. Kiss it. Get it down there. Have any of you guys jumped in with the PMDG 737-600? I got yeah, a... That's a bargain and a half, man. I got to say it. You don't have one. At, Go ahead. at 35 US dollars, it's a giveaway. Yeah. It's a steal. Yeah. Yeah, if you don't have the 700, just get the 600 and you're set. Yeah. I gotta be yep. honest, had I known this was gonna happen, I would have skipped the 700. Me too, but I didn't want to wait. Yeah, me too. I was exactly the same boat. And I had just gone to Hawaii on the 800. Well, when deplaning, I asked the captain, since he was just flying an 800, what he preferred to fly, 700 or 800. He, without question, he said the 700. If you compared it to flying a Ferrari versus a minivan, said okay that makes my choice easy I'm trying the fly-by-wire the free one it's, um, it's good enough for me that's pretty good with the latest update isn't it yeah it's okay if you're not in massively into jets it's, it's fine actually I'm still saving up for the Kodiak that is a fantastic oh. aircraft yes. Right, and absolutely. And I got a in I, I would rate it for GA mine number two. All right. Alps. Behind what, Mark? Uh, my favorite is uh, the Milvers Cessna 310R. 310. Uh, yeah, that's, that's a lot of I love that aircraft. Uh, save the 310. Agree with that the one. Three, 310's a twin. Yeah. It is, sir, yeah. But yeah. Uh, what a flight model on that. And yeah. what, and uh, what, you really got to be a bit careful when you're landing. Um, she really is a handful on landing, and if you get a strong crosswind, you got to be really careful. Could be my next purchase then. Yeah, uh, sounds, sounds good. good. I flew that around uh, oh South Dakota last time I flew it. A lot of fun. Just look at it, some is sites. Is it on the marketplace? Yeah, in the market. it is. Yes, yeah. it is. Has anybody actually flown the real Cessna 182? Mm, no, no, sir. I, no, I've, flown the one, I've flown the 152 and the 172. The stock ones. And the 208. No, no it, in, in, in the real world. In real life. Oh, in real life. Oh. 172 five, in real three. life. Yeah, 152. Yeah, 152. 150. The amazing thing is that same aircraft I flew back in 82 for a few hours still does circuits around the airport for the same flying club now. Huh. Oh, they do just keep on going, don't they? They do. Yeah. Amazing. It was a Ream Cessna, a French one as well. Yeah, Buzz MC was saying he hopes the 310 will come to the Xbox. Uh, me too. Once Wassim's in, I can't see any reason why it can't. Um, yeah, I actually spend more time in the 310 in the last six weeks than I'd probably have any other aircraft. Uh, i got to tell you, another one I really love, guys, is uh, the Phoenix uh, Airbus. It's beautiful. Absolutely I amazing. Absolutely. I... I, I really like how realistic it is and um, I watch um, I th is it 320 sim pilot, sim pilot. Yeah. and I watch into the blue um, and they give, give me a lot of information on, uh, I pick up a lot of information on, on the Airbus I really do like it yeah, we still have problems with the V uh, now when you get to it, it doesn't automatically start descending, does it? Or am I doing it wrong? Um, I, I think you're doing it wrong. <laughs> yeah, I thought that. <laughs> <laughs> Mark, have you picked up the 146 yet? Uh, 
Um, yes, I have. What are your thoughts on that? It's had a lot of rave reviews, and you'll notice I haven't done a review. Mm. Uh. <laughs> it's not your bag, maybe. It's just not my bag, guys. I uh, I don't want to knock it because it is a good plane. A lot of people like it. Um, I've taken it out of my hangar. Oh. Mm. Oh, oh, I like it. I like it. Oh. 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 oh that's my issue is I'm not going to buy it because I just don't care for the the aesthetics of it. It looks ridiculous to me. Four engines on a little plane like that. Uh, it just looks ridiculous. Many a happy hour at the Hatton production line every year. They had an open day to go and see them being built. And it, when I was a young spotter, they were they were the future. Oh, I, I used to live at the end of the runway, so I, you were uh, in my back garden. I was very fortunate on two occasions to actually fly in one and uh, I didn't fly it of course I was a passenger um, what are oh, fantastic absolutely yeah. fantastic you notice how funny they smelt inside though didn't smell like any other aircraft inside is that uh, simulator too I did notice that. No. <laughs> Simulator. <laughs> That's because when the guys were fitting them, a lot of well, as I say, they didn't bother going to the toilet. Um, <laughs> oh, well, they did. Oh, that was yeah. Come on, I didn't even no. go. the location I, of uh, my simulator. And I know because I was an apprentice there when they were building them, so I know what the guys <laughs> did inside them. <laughs> oh boy! Oh, oh, we must have got those ones then. Yeah. There was no Lean Six Sigma on that production line. <laughs> Sounds like man, just in if, time I, though. if I can, they just, used to smoke uh, inside them as well. Guys, if I can yeah. just brief you on the next landing. Okay, we're coming up on Snowbank Lake. Now we want to um, land heading north. In the middle of the lake is uh, a larger island. We want to land uh, to the right of the island. We want to head over to the east side, and we want to land. Uh, south to north and uh, between uh, the big island which we want to keep on our left and uh, the bank of the lake which is on our right Hope you that lost me sense. okay guys no you lost me <laughs> okay guys yeah, clear. <laughs> yeah made sense to me if you want to follow well, me I got it I got what he said okay so yeah. what I'm saying is we, for landing uh, in this lake there is an island in the middle we want to keep we want to land with the island on our left so we want to fly over the lake land heading north so come in from the south and keep the larger island in the center on your left hand side as you land and land between the island and the east bank of uh, Snowbank Lake. I hope that makes sense. Is it where the actual waypoint is located on the map? It is, isn't it? It's map back in the middle, yeah. yeah. More or less, yes, sir. Okay, I see the big island now. I'm just going to follow Tunesy. Yeah, just call me yeah, Shackleton. <laughs> I was a tad concerned, but oh. I'm not very now. Scenery is stunning. You're up. Yeah, if you're only a tad concerned, you're clearly not doing it right. You should be very concerned. <laughs> you're very concerned, not following Tunesy. Autopilot off. Come back on the power. Throttle and mixture fully forward. I'm going to land between the two small I'll just follow there. everybody else in. That way I'll get it right. That's it. That's how I do it. Guys, yeah, I, I've, I've just turned on final. Thank you. 
Well, you're coming more northeast than north. I am. Yeah, I am actually. I'm coming in on about uh, 58 degrees. Flaps two. And full flap. Full flaps. Full flaps. Gear up. Fishing that out. A little bit of a bounce. Oop. I'm down. Tunesy, this landing's going to be interesting for you. <laughs> oh no, no, you've only got floats, haven't you? It's yeah. It's wheels you haven't got. You should be no. all right. Yeah. The only, the only issue is the last runway, and I don't care then. Huh. As long as I crash into the bar. Like butter on an oil slick. <laughs> Water rudders down. There we go. Do any of these planes have sea anchors? <laughs> <laughs> you know, there is one that does. That's, isn't that the one with the fishing pole? What are, I forget which one that is. Though. Yeah, the goose. I'll the goose, yet. okay. Yeah. <laughs> I've got to say, guys, this is very, very exciting. Actually, doing this as a multiplayer with you guys. Yeah. Once you do multiplayer, cool. it's uh, it's addictive. Yeah. yeah, this is the first time. I've I've been waiting weeks to join you guys. I, I kept on having things going on, and I was like, ah. Oh. But uh, Mark, I just want to say, actually, um, I've got the Velocity One, and thank you so much for all the configurations that you've done for it, because it really made a difference. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Yeah, I'm right. I appreciate it too. I use your your uh, videos to set mine up. Yeah, it was amazing. I just sat there one Sunday morning and went through the video and just paused it where I needed to and configured it. Um, all I need to do is, is add the uh, backwards thrusters. <laughs> but um, yeah, absolutely fantastic. So thank you. Pleasure. Thank you. Has it been everything you dreamed it would be? <laughs> yeah, do you know? Do you know what? I mean, I'll be honest with you. Um, I I love it. I think it's great. I hope they do the um, the panel soon. You know what I mean? I, I think it's it's been a while now. It'd be great. Apparently, it's on the cards, isn't it? No, I, I, uh, meant, I meant flying with the group. Are you on next? <laughs> oh, sorry. I apologize. <laughs> um, yeah, it's been great. I've lo I've lost you a few times, to be honest with you. Um, I have to keep using. I've not had time to like plan it all out, but. Um, I've found you all again, so yeah, it's absolutely fine. I've put some of the headings in. I've I won't worry about that. Some of us have been here for a long time. We lose ourselves. <laughs> yeah. We don't know where we're going. Yeah. You're yeah. Liverpool in that accent. <laughs> well, the, the funniest, well, the funniest thing was when I was sort of, um, pl sort of planning it out because you guys, I tried to get in for six o'clock and I, I didn't quite manage it. And then I was like looking around the map and sort of planning it out. And then suddenly I just see all these green planes bundled together. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's it. That's the them. default method. If nothing else works, look for the horde. <laughs> yeah, that's just it. spawn on the one in front. And by the time you get in, you'll be halfway in the pack. It's fine. <laughs> you don't need a map. Just follow that crowd. You know, the bottom line is the one thing that Microsoft Flight Simulator got better than any other sim by miles is multiplayer. Yeah. Yeah, 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 for sure. That was great. You notice we've had no dropouts on this server. Most, most of us have had no dropouts at all. I know my my the ping others. my ping is quite poor, but it it gives. I've been on North Europe. I've had a ping of sixteen and people dropping in and out like a yo-yo. Yeah, so, this is definitely the best. Sorry, guys, are you still down at the moment? 
We are. Or are you up? Yes. No, You're down, down, are you? Yeah. Oh, right. Okay. In, I'm still down. the end of the oh. runway here. And we're oh, no. starting to. This is actually a pretty big lake. <laughs> yeah, this is a big lake. And where are you then? I'm at the oh, north just... end. I'm turning around to go south. Sorry. Not you, Scott. God. <laughs> I was the last one to talk. It's only right to assume he was talking to me. <laughs> me, 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 me. Um, uh, I, you, you, you. Radio check, Mike. I'm basically. Um, Hi, you Mike. guys are. Um, is it M M N five four? Or are you Snowbank Lake? Snowbank Lake, we're, isn't it? We're Snowbank Lake. Yeah. So I found you on the map. I've got um, a waypoint of M N five four, and then the last one, KC. KC, um, yeah. but what I'm doing is just putting myself in the air near you guys, um, so I can just take off when you guys take off, sort of thing. Yeah. So for future reference, there's a flight plan on my Discord. Um, right. It's under the event details section. You can find um, a flight plan which you download, load it straight in, and uh, you your aircraft will have the flight plan. How do you? Sorry, sorry to be naive, but um, I am I am on Discord, obviously, and I'm following. I've got the plan in front of me, but I'm stretching it so I can see what I'm doing. So, how would I put that onto the Xbox? How does that work? You have to type it in manually. There's yeah, yeah. There's that's, a that's download what... link. Right. Yeah, for Xbox, you need to type it in manually. Oh. That's what I've been doing. Yeah, that's what I've been doing. Oh, what? So type in your your actual um, flight plan, not because what I've been doing is putting is putting every single one in. Like no, for instance, where you, you started off KDLH, yeah. I was no, putting you, that in. You type in the full flight plan. Oh, okay, no problem. I'll do that next time. Okay, if you <laughs> have a look, um, some time ago, I've got a number of videos on how to do flight planning. On my channel, I watched it. I watched part of it today, but I was around my father-in-law, so I could only watch part of it. Yeah, yeah, I actually watched part of it today. Okay, great. Right, guys. So the next leg, we are departing here. We are going to be heading on a course of seventy-nine degrees to Mike November five four Gunflint. It's a landing on water. Uh, recommended altitude is 2,500 feet and when you're ready in any direction whatsoever because you'll do that anyway uh, let's <laughs> <laughs> let's finally getting it okay. <laughs> <laughs> let, let, let's head off <coughs> what's your name buddy me sorry okay. it's paul. Yes, paul yeah paul you say yeah. paul oh that's um, correct yeah paul yeah. Are All you right. Paul, Paul online? Is that who we see you as, yeah? No, I'm, I'm, I'm stupidly. I've got a name there that I just quickly put on there. It's Pablo Diablo. Oh, that's <laughs> fine. No, that's fine. <laughs> Pablo I'm Diablo. I was saying quickly. <laughs> Pablo Diablo. Uh, in the sim, is that. We'll see you in the sim. What will we see you as in the sim? Um, I don't know because I've not changed the name on the side of the plane, but I did watch Mark's video on how to do that, so I'll have to do that another time. No, it'll come up as whatever your um, gamer tag is. Yeah, it's a game. Oh, sorry. Um, it should be dorsal fin. Okay, easy to remember. Hey. Okay, <laughs> yeah, I haven't. I haven't seen you in the air. I'm. I'm coming now. Yeah, they all say that. <laughs> Hopefully, you guys. Oh God, it's a bit <laughs> cloudy now, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Don't you? I've missed you again. If you look back as you're leaving the lake, the sun's hitting it, and it looks absolutely fantastic. It's amazing. Yeah, yeah. lovely. Oh yeah. Yeah, you're going Anyway, how are you guys doing? I say it's Mike at G Chuff here. Sorry, I'm late joining. No oh, excuse, Mike. Mike. No how are you excuse. doing, Mike? Doing well. How are you doing, Mike? Hi, Mike. Hey, fine, right, thank you. Mike. I've been helping out at the Commonwealth Games today, so that's been good for the cycling in Warwick, because that's where I live. Oh, brilliant. I was, I was in Warwick yesterday. Lovely. Brilliant. Where did you play? Oh, that's the, the road race, was it? <laughs> yeah, it was the road race. It was yeah. uh, really been good for Warwick and Warwick Town as a whole. It's been really good. I'm burnt to a crisp, but apart from that, I'm okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was a hot one yesterday. Mike, are you, are you actually flying with us? 
I am, yes. I've just spawned in. I'm just uh, following everybody doing all weird things. I don't know where everybody's going, but anyway. What's your label, Mike? G Chuff. I'll pick another one. That's all right, Mike. We don't know just where we're going kidding. either. Just G, G Chub. Chub. Sure. Charlie Hotel Uniform <laughs> Foxtrot Foxtrot. I can see you to my right. Oh, wait. Oh, I'll my see friends you at three o'clock. Yeah, you're at three o'clock. What's the current I'm heading, guys? Just list? give me an idea. Uh, Easterly. 079. Thank you. I've got it. G oh, I see you. G Chub. In the. Uh, I'm on track. You guys should know, Mike's a regular on the flights. Yes, sure it is. Well, I'm sorry I've let you down, Mark, being late. I was so disappointed I couldn't wait to get back here. Well, it's the Simhanger flight or Commonwealth Games, I'd... obviously. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 I thought it was a no-brainer myself. <laughs> I wouldn't worry too much about it, Mike, because everywhere we've been has so strangely been closed and wouldn't just allow us in. <laughs> it's been horrible to get in and out unless you know the back routes and ways in it's been terrible to try and get in but it's really been good you know everybody's really good been amazing games though Mike it has yeah my wife wanted to go to the stadium but the trouble is if you're up in the stadium and you're looking down at people in the middle they're like pinpricks you can't really see anything it's best watching it on the telly yeah exactly All those cows are far away. Or are they very small? No, oh, they're not. They're small cows. Doodle. <laughs> those are far away. No, hey, don't get it, Ted. <laughs> Father Ted reminiscing. Excellent stuff. Just offline for a sec while I'll try and sort out why I can't get my rudder pedals to work. If there's anything at like that mark, you're looking at the wrong aircraft. Hey guys, we got Steve VR Flight Sim Guy saying hello from Norway. Just thought I'd pop by to say hi. Uh, have a of great course, flight. He's on his, uh, yeah, he's on his world trip, isn't he, around Norway? He went to the Arctic Circle the other day, didn't he? Sort of drama, Steve. Sort of drama. Thanks, Steve, for dropping Hello. in. Hope you're enjoying your holiday, my friend. Great. Hey, Steve, how's Steve. it going? Hi, Steve. Yeah. He says, hey, Buzz. Already looking forward to the announced Lofoten community flight which one Lofoten yeah you can think he's gonna do one when he gets back oh Steve's yeah that would be great lovely uh, Norway beautiful wowzers <laughs> uh, when, when we did Norway we had some absolutely stunning scenery yeah it was great Just swapped over to the uh, cub. Oh, have you? Up. Yeah. Makes a difference when you switch your USB port on, doesn't it? Yeah, it helps. Uh, yeah, gener <laughs> generally helpful. I found you all now. I'm heading in. Quick, everybody hide behind that cloud. <laughs> okay, the next landing at Gunflint, uh, gentlemen. Uh, the landing is landing runway east. Uh, the altitude at the airport is 1,546 feet 
and uh, there's a little spur of land and uh, the runway starts just after the little spur of land that juts out. Dorsal, did you make it in? And did you, did you catch up? I'm, um, <laughs> I've had to come out again. I'm just getting in now. Just going to find you guys now. So uh, you're MN54, are you? Just spawn on the head guy, man. Just whoever is the leader in the front, spawn yeah. on. By the time you get in, you'll you'll be about halfway in the pack. Yeah. I'm trying to see you, actually. Is it MN54 you, you guys are going to? Gunflint, is that right? Yeah, right. It is. Yeah. And we're not far out, so if you spawn there and wait for us, that would probably be the easiest for you. Yeah. Plus you can yeah. uh, critique everybody's uh, bad landings. <laughs> yeah, good idea. <laughs> as long as you have the drinks ready. Oh yeah. <laughs> <coughs> Mark, are you going to do another Warbirds um, stream? Yes yeah. sir, I am. Next month, I think, right? Yeah, next one coming up, uh, France and Switzerland. Fantastic. That's a great idea. I Not bought a P-51 Mustang just for that flight. I bought a Spit. P-38. That's what everybody's going to fly. P-38 P is my favourite at the moment. Yeah, roger that. P-38 is amazing. Yeah. Have, uh, is anybody flying the uh, the Milvis Corsair? I have real trouble with that sometimes. <laughs> I've flown it a few times. It's taking some getting used to. It's fine when I'm up in the air. It's just landing the damn thing. It seems to squibble all over the place once you hit the deck. Yeah, taking off the same way. Yeah, tail draggers. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, I I use the flying iron Spitfire it. Mark Nine. Yeah. Uh, Landing, flying, it's no problem at all, but taking off is such a challenge. Yeah, Sorry got... guys, quick question. Um, on the Velocity 1, <laughs> I forgot how to turn my propeller off, turn the engine off. What, what do I use? Um, I think it's fuel. I thought it was left... I thought it was left hat, left hat switch and... Yeah, that's what I thought it was, but... Just lean it right off, it'll conk out, then. Yeah. Why do you want to switch your motor off? Yeah, you don't want to do that. No one else does. Yeah, oh, okay. you never get a start again. At the moment, at the moment I'm just going around the lake. <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> everyone else will be doing the same thing, too. You don't want to do that. <laughs> what you want to do is you want to put it in neutral, mate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You want to put full weight while I spin round and round in circles and see if you'll stick. Yeah, if all else fails, just turn out the fuel pump. That's kind of what's happening at the yeah. moment. Hey to Mike Kelly. Hi, not able to join, but just wanted to say thanks, Mark, for the videos. Well, thank you very much, Mike. Much appreciated. Uh, and you're always welcome to join us if uh, the fancy ever takes you. Yeah, first time I tried to take off with the Corsair it, before I ever got close to rotating speed it wanted to go to the right yeah the torque oh. effect yeah. No. yeah yeah and that was with full left rudder yeah once you get in the air it flew pretty good but oh yeah uh, it's smashing in the air and as you say it goes like like this thing yeah uh, what I like about it is if you don't if you don't treat it kind, it, it spits oil all over the uh, the uh, the windshield. Yeah, yeah, mine did mine did out a few times. Yeah, and that's exactly what the real thing used to do. Apparently, if, if mishandled. Can I Which ask uh, how many people are flying in VR? Yep, you got me in VR. Yeah, yeah, I'm I'm in VR. Uh, wow. yep, I'm yeah, I'm in VR. Yeah. yeah. I don't sure. know. Yep. Yeah. Lame as well. The question should be who isn't in VR, eh? 
Xboxers. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm on Xbox. Yeah. It Hopefully it's coming. Yeah. Xboxers uh, and uh, Fearless Leader. Not in VR. No, I'm not because I'm doing the stream. I never. I, I, I'm a VR addict, but uh, not for the streams. It's just too difficult for me to manage everything. Yeah. You're on yeah, you're no VR. However, guys, anybody thinking about buying a VR headset today, right now, is it's quite a difficult thing to do. Um, because there's quite a lot of interesting stuff uh, coming up, uh, hopefully in the not-too-distant future. So it'll be interesting to see how things develop. What are you talking about? Uh, HP. Pimax. There's, uh, well, there's uh, Pimax with... with with the crystal, no. uh, and they got the other Reaper. one coming. They they got the other one coming out. Um, there's uh, talk uh, about the valve decard, of course. How about a reverb G3? I I wish there was, but I have I've heard nothing about that. At Steve all. Steve seems to have talk to HP he's very coy about what he'll say about it but it's, it's at least on one flight uh, it sounded like uh, he thought the a new version was coming pretty soon I'd be Steve great. Walton? it'd be great if it, it is but I have heard there will be a G3 it's inevitable but uh, I hear nothing about any imminent release but I don't know Steve may know better could well be Somebody was claiming in the forums that HP no longer stock the hand trackers. So, whether discontinuing, I don't know. Use well, they've been running a sale. IT kit and they've got no stock full stock. We've been waiting for about six months for laptops. They're really struggling with in inventory at the minute. Yeah, and I think that has a lot to do with the supply more than perhaps discontinuing. However, uh, I noticed the G2 been on sale in various places around the world. Uh, it was for sale for 400 US recently. Yeah, yeah, that's that a was steal. a July 4th sale. Has there ever be an option for VR in uh, with the Xbox? Do you think, or is it just not powerful enough? It is powerful enough, um, for sure. It's powerful enough, yeah. but. It's not the direction that uh, they're going in at the moment, but uh, the PS5 is bringing out the PSVR 2. Um, and I just wonder how long it will be before the Xbox is pushed in that direction. I would guess, um, and I don't know, I'm just purely speculating here, it won't, it'll be, VR will be available on the Xbox Series X's successor, whenever that may be. Yeah. No, for now I stick to my 75 inch TV then. <laughs> it's not bad either. <laughs> yeah, for this, for this kind of flying though, I just couldn't not do it in VR, it's awesome. Yeah, absolutely. We're landing? We're landing, sir. I'm just heading not right now. Well, I'm. Is this water landing or a strip? This is supposedly a water landing. If it's a strip landing for you, something's gone terribly wrong. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's quite possible. Flaps one. Uh, <laughs> I just caught myself reaching up for the uh, flaps control instead of on my quadrant. I love it when that happens. That's one gear up. It means you're starting to lose yourself into the into the into the uh, immersion of VR. What an amazing view with the sun! Wow, beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Flaps full. Here come the duckies. Flaps. Yeah. <laughs> Sixty knots. Is that Huey or Dewey? <laughs> I wouldn't know. Hold, hold the Donald nose Duckers. on the horizon and hold back pressure on the stick. Ooh, there we go.
My twin otter just took the top of my aircraft off. <laughs> Sorry about that, Mark. That was me. <laughs> Trying desperately me. to overrun you. <laughs> but it could have been me. Let me know when you fly again, guys. I can I'm see you I'm in the right all, mood. But, it could well um, be me. Let me know when you go up again, because I need to go up with you again. I've lost you again. Are you on the Southeast Asia server? Oh yeah, no, no. I've got, I've got, I've got you all. I've got you all. It's just because I'm trying to work out how to start the engine and turn off the engine. I had to come out again because I was just going round and round the lake. <laughs> so I've basically got you all now. So it looks like you're all down on the lake. Is that correct? Correct. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Almost. Yeah. <laughs> Almost. Well. Yeah. So as soon as you give me the go ahead to go up, I'll, I'll then join you. Well, guys, for any of I'm... you that have landed, look behind you at the sun. Um, yeah, uh, across fantastic. the lake and yeah, oh, it's absolutely stunning oh yeah there is. get it down now my cloud Chunzi. settings are paying off <laughs> get it down Chunzi it's down look at that <laughs> like butter now I'm just going to handbrake turn it <laughs> <laughs> and he is <laughs> Uh, there we go. Looks good. Hamburg County doing, Yunkers. Doing donuts in a car park next Tuesday. <laughs> what an aircraft. Just looking on the uh, stream now to KJ86. Hi, everyone. MVR. Great. Um, Oliver. When I launch the game, I try to log in, but Microsoft sends the wrong email. Uh, contact uh, Microsoft support, my friend. I'm not quite sure what you mean by that when you log in. Um, you, I, I'd need more details. If you need more help, you'll need to go to the Discord, please. And M Family Channel, how do you join? Join the SimHanger Discord. Go to event details section once you've joined the Discord and there are help videos and all future flight details. No, no, it no. looks like it's hats, hat, hat switch. No, no, it stops on its own. It's a watercraft, mate. You can't do anything to stop it. Yeah. Just take the throttle off and it stops on its own. Oh, okay. Right, there everything's off. There ain't no brakes. Well, I'm up okay, yeah, down. we are. Oh, I'm not yeah. down. I thought I was they down. Do. I thought I was down. Get down. Get down. Looks like everybody's down. Yes. Yep. I'm I, yep. I yep. believe they are. Yeah. Okay. The last leg, captains. Uh, we're heading off to uh, a waypoint, <clears throat> which is Jitsi, Juliet, India, Delta, Sierra, India, heading one four nine. You need to climb to 3,500 feet because we're hitting some higher ground. And then once we're over Jitsi, it is a left-hand turn into um, Kilo, Charlie, Kilo, Charlie, Grand Marie, and uh, landing runway 10, and it's a hard surface. Although I am waiting for final ATC clearance to confirm yeah. we can land. Uh-oh. <laughs> Yeah, we already know the answer. Yeah. Oh, well, sorry. <laughs> we're we're painting, watching the stream anyway. <laughs> we're painting the runway, sorry guys. Checking how full my tanks are. And when you're ready, let's yeah. go. I'm, let's just fly right into the sun for takeoff, so you can watch it. Looks really nice. That's an excellent idea. I'm going to do that. What time of day is everybody got there? We've got a guys. We got a message uh, on the stream from uh, Q8 pilot, uh, the man who joined us for our very first fly-in, and a great YouTuber. Q8 pilot, thank you very much, and he's saying hello, guys. Hope you're enjoying. How's it going? <laughs> Good guy. How you doing out there, QH? Oh, Q8. Q8. <laughs> Q8. Oh, it's an Kuwait. It's 2017 for whoever just Kuwait. asked what the time is. It's he's from Kuwait. I wonder if he's from yeah. Kuwait. Q8. He, he is. is from he's Kuwait. Kuwait. He's he is? Kuwait. Yeah. 
Well, yeah, that's I, clever now. That's a yeah, that's clever, clever name. We used to have an oil company called Q8, and it was based in Q8, funnily enough. Yeah. All right. Into the sun, gents. Into the sun. Mm, away from the sun. Oops, heading the wrong way. I see you guys. I'm actually turning in behind you because I had to go up for some reason. It just... Whoa. Just a reminder, guys. 3,500 feet for this lake. 3,500. Get Toby Eye Tracker back on, that's easier. Flaps are up. Okay. You don't need a massive rate of climb, but a decent rate of climb, four, five hundred feet, because uh, the ground does rise suddenly, unexpectedly. I thought it was just me going in a different direction, but I'll see a few of you. <laughs> Don't worry, that's perfectly normal. Yeah. <laughs> that's our standard operating procedure. <laughs> <laughs> this is brilliant, by the way, guys. This is awesome. So heading uh, for anybody that needs it is uh, 149. So roughly 150 degrees, guys. Thank you. Yeah, it's a good way to relax. Oh, zero I cap. Back like to school in the morning, then. Yeah. Now, now, I've got uh, the drone camera on, uh, looking at everybody coming forward with the sunset in the background it's absolutely beautiful it's the one thing microsoft really does no other sim can match this oh, superb yeah i think second to the multiplayer the uh yeah. the get me on my good awesome, side isn't it? you have a good side <laughs> you're, looking at it, you're looking at it out the right out your right window there mark Mark, does uh, X-Plane 12 have multiplayer? Um, complex question. <laughs> <laughs> um, it, you, you can do um, that sim, IBAO and what have you. And I don't know about uh, built-in multiplayer. Uh, yeah. you, can, you can, through various third-party apps, do multiplayer. But in X Plane 11.5, it's not an inherent part. Uh -huh. it, it requires an add on, I think. And uh, yeah. um, it's more complicated than it should be. Yeah, my, my local flight sim group uses a, I can't remember the name of the server now, but we're on our own server. Um, we use a variety of different connection tools, but it, lots and lots of different sims, so flight sim, um, X-Plane and so on can all actually fly together. Um, but man oh man, it's hard work to, yeah. to get it working. Sounds yeah. like an FSD server. Probably. I, it, it's been a while since I've been in, because frankly, yeah. multiplayer in MSFS is just so easy. Yeah. Yeah, I can't remember the... the I, I think it's FS something was the... The, like the multiplayer link that we used the app but i can't remember its name it, it should eventually be coming it's, it's built into their mobile app i know austin keeps on saying that he wanted it working on mobile before working on pcs
Uh, I have a question, if I may, for those of you who are, who are using uh, Spat Next. Yeah. Um, does Spat Next work with the Verpil uh, button boxes or control part panels? I don't know the answer to that, to be honest. Um, I know a guy who will know. Uh, Shark will know. Uh, Maverick, yeah. I'm going to guess. He, he would know. Um, he is the fountain of knowledge. Um, uh, yes, I have a is on not. <laughs> I have a verbal throttle, and I've got the uh, dials mapped in uh, Flight Simulator. Yeah, so that oh, means yeah, it's showing up as a Windows buttons, isn't it? So that should be then mappable with almost anything. Yeah, I would. I, I would say off the top of my head, yes, but I. I can't stand by that because I don't know for sure. Okay. Thank you very much nonetheless. Uh, Chris Fahey here. Uh, as this is my first flight, I wanted to take the opportunity, Mark, to thank you. You've, you've made the learning curve much easier for for many many people with your uh, excellent videos thanks well thank you absolutely yeah well, yeah you. absolutely yeah. for that that's one to that oh, thank yeah. you. thanks very much guys i do appreciate it it's why i did it. it it's actually why i got into creating it i got so frustrated um very often you see a review of a product but then no follow-up yeah um and uh, very often what makes the sim enjoyable is actually the detail. Um, anything can look good on the top, but you've got to be able to use it. Are you sure? Yeah. I'm just waiting Best for... Best sim videos out there, in my opinion, Marks. There is a very knowledgeable man speaking. Yes. <laughs> 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 oh dear! I'm glad you recognize it. Don't, don't, <laughs> let's for, let's for, see who wins the prize today. Yeah, there's for, a man who's <laughs> desperate to win the giveaway. <laughs> for God's sakes, don't encourage me. <laughs> Have to I forward want to some say, uh, an, Xbox uh, dollars over to you. I want to say, Mark, I'm impressed by your humility, also. Yes. <laughs> Are we landing on the lake here, or is it a, a um, hard runway? I'm waiting for a clearance. Um, we are oh. to, it's to be a hard landing at uh, Kilo Charlie, Kilo Charlie. I'm just waiting for clearance or whether we're going to be diverted. All right. It's getting dark. It is. There's the moon. Why did I get the moon? moon. Your time should be around, around, uh, mine is, uh, 2021. 20, yep, um, you should be more or less around 2020, 2030 20, thereabouts. And then you're going to get this beautiful sunset. I've just had ATC on the line and guess what? Oh. They've, the given us, the light bulbs. they've given us clearance to land. Oh, oh, excellent, Yay. you're down. Idiots. Sure. <laughs> 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 That's a I hard hat. They, they, no they don't know what they're you, in for. You cannot stop the attack. <laughs> Charge. So, runway 10, <laughs> the, <laughs> on the uh, left-hand side, guys, you should be able to see the flashing lights of the uh, airport and of run runway 10. Oh. So, it's a left-hand turn into runway 10. Altitude is 1803. Oh, glad you see those flashing lights too, man. I think I might come in last because I'm going to make a bit of a sparky entrance on this one. Chunzi, uh -oh. please <laughs> let me land first so I can catch you. Yeah, no, I will. I'll, I'll try and come in last and let everyone have a laugh. Right. I'll circle Pretty around. Careful. The ones that are last right now are the Icon A5s. And I'm saying yes. they're sitting in one. Yeah. How far behind are you guys? 
Um, we're the last two. I don't know. I think Soaring uh, Guy's at the back of the group. Uh, Slappy, maybe. Tony Dark. Pig Sly. Are you Who's all in, in the there? Ultralight? Icon. <laughs> Let me know when you're down and aim in your camera, Mark. Yeah, I will do. You guys can just uh, give me a moment to get down. I'm just turning on to final now, and then I can capture you guys coming in. That'll be great. A great way Auto to end stream? the stream. I the have sunset Kelly looks really good on my plane. Really caught up with us. And I know you all love being caught on camera, so... Are you here, Dorsal? No. Are you in the group? Uh, I have him at my 9 o'clock. Oh, ah, coming in. Baptism of fire, buddy. Guy's up so nicely. I'm not sure where I am here. Um... Three, five, two. I'm following Fogger Warren. Are oh, you joking? Just, uh, just, just point the 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 sort of long, pointy, buzzy thing you're sitting in towards <laughs> the long, hard, concretey, flashy thing on the floor. Do you know? Oh, do you know? With that what? sort of advice, you should do videos. Right. I I wish I could that is it. the voice of a <laughs> certified flight instructor, right there. Right. <laughs> yeah, I just bought a pattern book. Uh, uh, from the, the local sort of free library, the what's quick, his name, Patterbook. Quick reminder to everybody: don't forget to put your gear down. Oh, thank what you. gear? <laughs> I forgot to install my gear on the aircraft. I was actually going to choose the Junkers, but because I couldn't get one with gear and floats, I I didn't choose it. Ignore the. Uh, the graphic glitch which shows runway 10 uh, before the actual runway here we go coming in flaps are full gonna try and make this an abrupt landing so I can film the guys okay, coming in. Okay, gonna turn off final then. I may live to regret that. Whoops, bit of a bounce. You and me, Steve, bringing up the rear. Break, break, break. Hoo hey, uh, hoo -ah. Okay. Full throw. Collapse Overcome up. friction. Don't land yet. Don't land yet, guys. Well, hurry up. Ah, I'm doing it. <laughs> I need a wee. I can't oh, see the one for all the name tags back here. <laughs> uh, skew it on in there. Come on in, guys. Come on in. Woohoo! Right. go around. Uh, a carabo. Nice one. Thank you. Flaps 20. Slappy DRP. Nice. You're down safe and sound. Here comes Golf Mike. Farmer Hyde, nice. You're down safe and sound, sir. You stopped on nothing. Cracker Jack coming down. Toby Air. Duck speak, nice. Guys, once you're down, taxi to the terminal. I think terminal is kind of a nice term for this. Get it down, crummy bread, get it down. Boris Bold, nice. Here comes Night Shift, Lucky 86, Doberman, very nice sir. Thank you very much. Thank you.
Oh, Martha looks a bit bewildered. Got to say that uh, it was that was all rather well done, guys. A little disappointing. <laughs> <laughs> Never fear. <laughs> Shall I crash for you? Well. <laughs> I, I made up for it, Mark. You see that? <laughs> I wasn't going to mention that. <laughs> In the glide path. Very kind. Flaps thirty. Oh, I'm down, but oh, come on, come on, come on. Damn you, bugger. Dorsa Finn, you are running out of runway. <laughs> oh no, oh no. <laughs> I'm trying. Gear down, come on. Turn the engine off. Oh, for God's sake. Here we go. I will land. The bloody thing crashed about half a mile from the the runway. Four flaps. Let me see the bitch. <laughs> the ground vehicle. They don't know where to go. <laughs> this actually looks like one of the more organised parking jobs I've seen. <laughs> And we're down. Oh god, <laughs> it's going towards me. <laughs> Once you've landed guys, let's just taxi to the terminal and we'll just do the quick giveaway. Use your reverse, ho. <laughs> that was bad. <laughs> That was bad. HL45, you have reverse thrusters. Yeah. <laughs> it's all right. The bloody thing okay. crashed about three miles out. Mark, right? how, do <laughs> so it's been Mark how do I stop the engines on the Velocity 1? Sorry, say again. How do I stop the engines on the Velocity 1? Oh, Don't uh, worry about it. Make room in the car park, guys. I'm coming in. You, you uh, are. <laughs> you, all, all you do is kill the... Uh, uh, the mixture. Pull the mixture full lean and that will do it. I've, I've done, yeah, I've done that backwards. Both mixture and throttle were back. Oh, I forgot to. Oh, uh -oh. sorry, guys. Building. I'm going to have to change some time. Oh, okay. Um, I rolled my aircraft. Yeah, I'm sort of in the middle somewhere as well. I'm upside down on the hangar behind you, but it's pretty enough. Right, gentlemen, let's just do the quick giveaway. There um, are two today. Um, the first one is uh, it is a just flight or sim market um, to the value of 15 pounds and the second one is a just flight or or sim market value of 20 pounds and uh, if you're on Xbox then it will be an Xbox gift card as close to that value as I can subject to you living and unfortunately it has to be subject to you living in a country where I am allowed to buy an Xbox um, gift card all right <laughs> so let me spin this wheel and let me tell you who the first winner is Maverick <laughs> You're joking! Not a chance. Never. No Never. way. Come on. Hang on. <laughs> fix, Shit, fix, 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 fix. Hurt me then. Ma Maverick, Maverick, it's not you. Oh, thank God for that. <laughs> <laughs> you shit. <laughs> Excuse my language. Excuse my language. Right. Let me spin the wheel, guys. Stop messing you around. Hang on. <laughs> you buggers. <laughs> I will never let you down on that one. We have a winner! Maverick! Maverick. <laughs> Come on. It's not you again. Um, 
<laughs> okay, guys, the winner of the £15 uh, Just Flight Sim Market or Xbox is Buzz MC 7 We well are Buzz. Hey, well, well done, mate. Congratulations. Well done, well Buzz. Well done, well done, well done, well done, well done. Buzz. I'm not flying anymore. <laughs> Shit. Let's go with Buzz for the game. And the <laughs> second winner is uh, uh, uh i'm cutting my headphones off <laughs> <laughs> the second window is Wombleway. dave well done my friend yeah, yeah, not fantastic. Fantastic. Well, well, congratulations. Congratulations. fantastic congratulations yeah, thank you Wombleway, haven't you won before i have well, i thought so <laughs> you and maverick must be related yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so to related play, to mark you mean so to Buzz, Buzz MC <laughs> and to uh, Wombleway, if you drop me a personal message, please, on uh, on Discord. I need to know PC or Xbox and what your preference is. Um, if it's PC, it is Just Flight or Sim Market. Uh, I also need to know what country you're in and your email address, please. To everybody Cheap. else, um, I'd just like to again give a shout out to uh, FS Academy for sponsoring this it's a big help to me um, and to the channel helps me continue to bring stuff to you so uh, make sure to have a look at the FS Academy offering guys it's Xbox and PC compatible so thanks to them but a special thanks um, to all of those on the stream that have joined and commented um, that's great thank you very much and especially to everybody who's joined me on the flight the next flight uh, there's a bit of a gap guys it's going to be around subject to confirmation the 18th of uh, September so quite a gap the reason being is I'm going to be taking a little bit of time off at the end of August um, having a holiday and also a little bit of time off from YouTube for a week or two um, I thought you were going to say time off from you <laughs> you burned it. You burned it, Mark. Yeah, <laughs> yeah don't blame him. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, you know, after a while, you can get a bit YouTubed out, can't you? So, um, but that's it. And guys, thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, absolutely, and, always. And I, I just trying Been to great. have a look here quickly before you go, just to confirm. Where are we? We are, yeah, eighteenth of September. It's Warbirds. Warbirds, right? Okay. We're going. It's War. uh, when I say Warbirds, it's uh, Warbirds. If you can, it has to be pre nineteen fifty. Um, it's definitely props, and uh, we're going to be uh, departing uh, from uh, France and heading into Switzerland. And then coming up after that, the October fly is going to be South Island Tour New Zealand. Oh, nice. That'd be good. Really yeah. good. 13th of November. November. The November one is subject to confirmation but and subject to uh, Asobo and Microsoft doing their thing. Uh, the plan is helicopters. Um, oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> really good. That, Lovely. That should be some fun. Um, you have them by the time on Xbox. Yeah, yeah, Seven. they yeah, yeah, they should I be out. You're doing big iron in November. Yeah, I've swapped that uh, for helicopters, but uh, December is big iron uh, airliners. If helicopters aren't out in time, I'll then s push the big Correct. iron into November, and then uh, between Christmas and New Year, for those of you that are available, we'll be doing uh, Discord only. It won't be streamed. We'll just be doing. Uh, uh, between Christmas and New Year flying. So thank you everybody so much for joining me on stream and joining me in the flight. Have uh, a great uh, week next week. Look after yourselves. I'll see you all again very Thanks, soon. Mark. Thank you very Thanks, much. Mark. Thank, you, Mark. Thank, thank you very much. much. Thank you very much. Thanks, Thanks, Mark. 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 Thanks,